Guys in Vega, long time veteran here in reality of wrestling, a long time member of La Familia, saying kind of backstage, Kirby, that he, he wanted to show El Jefe that he's got the chops to get it done. He does feel like he's going to get the job done here tonight, but his opponent is going to be a world travel competitor that we have never seen here in the reality of wrestling. And quite frankly, y'all, I am excited to welcome Shao Kai here to the reality of wrestling. Shao Kai, we've seen his vignettes on television at Reality of Wrestling here for the last several weeks. And now we await his debut all the way from Malaysia. Such an impressive resume. I know you can give us more about Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn is one of the most famous professional wrestlers in all of Southeast Asia. He has traveled through the Philippines, through Singapore, through Hong Kong. Everybody knows who Shao Kahn is. The prophet of pain, as he likes to call himself. And the one move that we gotta watch out for is gonna be that back elbow that he connects with. He calls that the prophecy fulfilled. And that is what his mission is here tonight at the Reality of Wrestling. And Jonathan Vega may have bit off more than he can chew with Shao Kahn. I mean, just the, uh, the aura of Shao Kahn, you can feel. Uh, yes, the presence of Shao Kahn here. Ro Nation already on their feet for him. I mean, this is this is epic. This is historic here at the World Gym Arena, and uh, <laughs> Vega doesn't know what's coming. The first competitor from Southeast Asia to be here in a reality or wrestling squared circle. I am excited to see what he can bring. Jonathan Vega is not one to go down without a fight. This is a man who's a former Reality Wrestling Tag Team Champion, a longtime veteran. We've talked about it on weeks past. This is a home game, if you will, for Jonathan Vega. Even if the Row Nation isn't on his side, he still has the familiarity. And look, Shao Kahn oh. catching oh, that right arm. And as you said before, Brad, is Vega trying to prove to El Jefe that he, he can get the job done. He's not ordered to take this all the way. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is a great way to prove yourself if you're Jonathan Vega. Right now, Shao Kahn. Oh. Right hand. Now you want to talk about this being a home game for Vega, y'all. Let me tell you a little bit about Shao Kahn here. The man actually began his career when he met our boss himself, Booker T. Booker T was the one that gave him that motivation to begin his career in professional wrestling. And it was just a few years ago on Twitter where Shao Kahn said himself that he was going to make his way to the reality of wrestling one day. And now he's here and he wants to impress the boss. I am already impressed with Shao Kahn here as wrestling has several different styles, but you see how methodical and quiet Shao Kahn is. Cover here. One. Kick out after one. Everything he does feels very reserved, but I can guarantee you he's got a plan in his head already. Oh, look, look at this. this. Whoa. Sub looking for a submission, it looks like, and going back to work on that right arm. Oh but Jonathan goodness. Vega, Jonathan Vega writhing in pain, but able to get to a rope. Shao Kahn breaking the hold, but maybe he broke a couple ligaments there. In, in Jonathan Vega's right arm. It doesn't take long and it doesn't take much. Jonathan Vega, the Chicago, Illinois native, moving down to Houston, Texas. Oh, look at his here. Cover, kick out. Moving down to Houston, Texas several years ago. 
to learn under the expert tutelage of trainers such as Booker T himself. But Shao Kahn. Oh. Oh. Now Jonathan Vega showing his speed here against the power. Yeah. Shao Kahn connects with that leg drop into the cover, too. The kick out. Some are watching on a television in Tahiti is Booker T and the Queen. Overseas try to work things out between them. Of course, Abel Andrew Jackson is the acting authority figure and general manager in the absence of the king and queen. I mean, everyone needs a little vacay to, to kind of rest and rejuvenate, and they, they need that definitely after what we saw. Well, absolutely. And coming up next, ladies and gentlemen, is the singles competition for the Reality of Wrestling Texas Championship. Now Shaw Cotts trying to fire back here, trying to regain his composure here against Jonathan Vega, because it's been all Jonathan Vega over the past few minutes. As now Shao Kahn may have found that opening with that clothesline there. Oh, look at that. Oh. The prophet of pain predicting Vega's moves. It looks like he's calling for... Oh! oh. Going right to that arm again of Vega. That, that right arm. That knee strike to the chest. He calls that the creeping death. And that is usually what foretells this here. Oh, but look at this. Jonathan Vega gets out of the way. He did his homework on Shawcott. Oh, nice blow there to the back by Shawcott. Oh, oh, here he goes. He's going for the fatal prediction. Oh, the fatal prediction lands. And that's going to be all she wrote for Jonathan Vega. Shawcott with an impressive debut here at the Reality of Wrestling, putting away a former tag team champion here in his World Gym Arena debut. And although the prophecy fulfilled was not needed, that fatal prediction was a devastating maneuver. As we hope to see Shawcott once again here at the World Gym Arena.